Hello everyone and welcome to our YouTube channel. Rumors and news have been swirling in recent weeks about a bombshell revelation from Diddy's former bodyguard, Jean Deal. If you are new to our channel, support by subscribing and don't forget to hit that notification button for more updates. In a tell all interview, Deal allegedly claimed that media mogul Oprah Winfrey was a regular VIP attendee at Diddy's exclusive and secretive house parties over the years. This explosive allegation has sent shockwaves through the entertainment industry, raising questions about the nature of Oprah and Diddy's relationship and the goings-on at these private gatherings. Today, we're going to dive deep into this developing story and unpack all the details. We'll examine Jean Deal's claims, look at the potential implications, and try to separate fact from fiction. By the end of this video, you'll have a comprehensive understanding of this juicy celebrity scandal that could forever change how we view two of the biggest names in media. For those unfamiliar, Diddy has long been known for hosting extravagant, invite-only house parties at his various mansions and estates around the world. These gatherings have developed a reputation for being the stuff of urban legend, high-profile celebrities, free-flowing alcohol, scandalous behavior, and a lot of secrecy. Over the years, many have speculated about the nature of these parties and who exactly attends. Diddy has rarely spoken publicly about the events, maintaining an air of mystery. But according to his former bodyguard, Jean Deal, one of the most surprising regular guests was none other than media mogul Oprah Winfrey. In a recent interview, Deal claimed that Oprah Winfrey was a frequent VIP attendee at Diddy's house parties, often arriving separately from the hip-hop mogul and mingling with the other high-profile guests. Deal alleges that Oprah would party well into the night, indulging in the free-flowing alcohol and socializing with the other A-listers present. Oprah was there all the time, Deal stated. She had her own special entrance and they'd usher her right in, away from the regular guests. She'd hang out with Diddy and his closest friends, drinking and chatting. Nobody would expect to see Oprah at these kinds of parties, but there she was, having a great time. Deal went on to claim that Oprah's attendance was kept strictly confidential, with Diddy and his team going to great lengths to ensure the media mogul's presence remained under wraps. There were always NDAs and tight security. Nobody was allowed to take photos or videos of Oprah being there. It was like she was part of Diddy's inner circle. If true, these allegations from Jean Deal would certainly cast Oprah's relationship with Diddy in a very different light. Oprah has long cultivated a carefully curated public image as a moral authority and positive role model. The idea of her regularly attending raucous, exclusive house parties known for their debauchery could seriously damage that reputation. Furthermore, it raises questions about the nature of Oprah and Diddy's relationship. Were they merely friends, or was there something more intimate going on behind the scenes? Oprah has always maintained a professional distance from Diddy, but Deal's claims suggest a much closer connection. The revelations have already sparked a flurry of reactions on social media, with many fans and observers expressing shock and disappointment. Some have even gone so far as to call for Oprah to address the allegations directly. However, both Oprah and Diddy have remained tight-lipped on the matter, neither confirming nor denying Deal's claims. Of course, it's important to note that these are still just allegations made by a single source, Diddy's former bodyguard, Gene Deal. While Deal has positioned himself as an insider with first-hand knowledge, there hasn't been any independent verification of his claims as of yet. It's possible that Deal could be exaggerating or fabricating details for attention or personal gain. Alternatively, he could be telling the truth, but perhaps misinterpreting or misremembering certain aspects of Oprah's involvement. Without corroborating evidence or statements from Oprah or Diddy themselves, it's difficult to determine the accuracy of Deal's explosive revelations. In the end, this developing story remains largely shrouded in mystery and unanswered questions. If Jean Deal's claims are indeed true, it could fundamentally change how we view both Oprah Winfrey and Diddy's public personas. However, without further confirmation or evidence, we can't say for certain whether this is a genuine scandal or simply tabloid fodder. Regardless, the revelations have sparked intense curiosity and debate within the entertainment industry and among the general public. As we wait to see how this story unfolds, one thing is clear, the alleged ties between Oprah and Diddy's private parties are sure to remain a topic of intense fascination and speculation for some time to come.
All right, let's dive deeper into this developing story surrounding Oprah Winfrey's alleged ties to Diddy's exclusive house parties. There are still many unanswered questions and intriguing details to unpack. While Oprah and Diddy have maintained a relatively low-key public relationship over the years, the two media moguls have actually known each other for decades. They first crossed paths in the 1990s when Diddy was just starting to make a name for himself in the music industry. Oprah was an early champion of Diddy, inviting him onto her show multiple times and even collaborating with him on various charitable initiatives. By all accounts, they developed a friendly, professional rapport, but according to Gene Deal's claims, their relationship may have been more intimate than previously known. Eyewitness accounts and corroborating evidence Beyond Gene Deal's initial revelations, there have been some additional eyewitness accounts and hints of corroborating evidence emerging. Various anonymous sources, who claim to have attended Diddy's parties, have come forward to corroborate Deal's statements about Oprah's regular presence. I remember one time, Oprah just showed up with her security detail. She was hanging out with Diddy and his VIP friends all night, sipping on cocktails and laughing it up, one alleged partygoer told a gossip website. It was the most surreal thing, seeing Oprah at one of Diddy's wild parties. But she seemed totally at home there. Furthermore, some eagle-eyed fans have pointed to subtle social media interactions and photos over the years that may suggest a closer relationship between Oprah and Diddy than they've let on publicly. While not definitive proof, these small breadcrumbs have only fueled more speculation. If these allegations about Oprah's involvement in Diddy's private parties prove to be true, the potential fallout could be substantial for both public figures. Oprah has built her entire brand and legacy around being a beacon of morality, empowerment, and positivity. Being linked to the hedonistic world of Diddy's exclusive gatherings could seriously undermine that carefully curated image. Diddy, on the other hand, has long been associated with a certain level of excess, indulgence, and controversy. Having one of the most respected and influential women in media regularly attending his parties could potentially lend an air of respectability to his reputation. However, it could also backfire if the revelations make Oprah appear complicit in or endorsing Diddy's purported party lifestyle. Both Oprah and Diddy have remained silent on the matter so far, likely attempting to avoid further fueling the flames of speculation. But the longer they remain silent, the more the public imagination will run wild with theories and assumptions. Beyond the reputational damage, there are also potential legal and professional ramifications that could arise from these allegations, depending on the specifics of what may have occurred at Diddy's parties. For instance, if evidence emerges that illegal substances were present or that guests engaged in inappropriate or unethical behavior, both Oprah and Diddy could face scrutiny and potential consequences. Oprah's position as a respected media figure and philanthropist could be jeopardized, while Diddy's business dealings and entertainment empire may also come under intense public and legal scrutiny. Additionally, if there are any allegations of improper conduct, power dynamics, or exploitation at these parties, that could open up a whole other can of worms with serious legal implications for those involved. In conclusion, the news surrounding Diddy's former bodyguard's allegations about Oprah Winfrey's attendance at the mogul's notorious house parties has captivated the public imagination. While the details remain murky and unconfirmed, the potential implications of these revelations are substantial. Ultimately, the only way to get to the bottom of this scandal and provide clarity is for Oprah and Diddy to directly address the allegations in a transparent manner. Whether they choose to confirm, deny, or simply remain silent, their response, or lack thereof, will likely shape the public's perception and the lasting impact of this developing story. As we wait with bated breath for any official word from the two media titans, one thing is certain, the alleged ties between Oprah and Diddy's exclusive parties will continue to be a topic of intense fascination and speculation in the entertainment world.